Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Modded Art. It's early in the morning and a good thing because we have a ton of stuff to get done today. So, we're going to be working on getting our hazmat suit made so we'll be able to go down into the rock trick area to grab some eggs. The hazmat suit will protect us. Then we need to get stuff together to make some mushroom brew, mushroom stew, mushroom soup, something like that. <laughs> That'll protect the thyla. So the thing is, we got to go back up into one of the artifact caves to grab some of the mushrooms. I don't know where else to get them from. We need to make some tree sap taps and a tree platform. Throw those up in the redwoods to get us some tree sap. We need to grab some congealed gas. Or actually, I think it's called condensed gas. Put it into our forges, make some congealed gas. One or the other. You know where I'm going with this. And then go down in the aberration cave to grab some blue crystals. And that... We'll get it set up to steal some rock drag eggs. It is a long process, so let's get started. I think we're good over here. Let's double check the feather raptors before we go. I got them on full overtime egg production. Get us as much of this kibble made as we can. You got some eggs? You're still making some, huh? So I got some regular raptor eggs from those guys. Not fertilized, just the ones that they drop themselves. It's kind of weird how they give you regular raptor eggs what are we missing we got enough honey and everything in there we've actually got too much honey let's go ahead and grab this out i don't want it all to spoil i know we've got a ton of it but no reason in kind of like wasting it you know so we're doing fairly well on the kibble we're up to 21 now so it's not too bad not too bad so let's see let's get some stuff made over here We'll do four of these. And I hope we have enough stuff. What's the difference in the S plus one and a regular? Resources are a lot higher on the S plus. I think it might have more clip points, but we're not building on it, so it doesn't matter. Let's just build the cheaper one. We're missing cement paste. Fantastic. Tell you what, let's jump on. We got the Thyla on us. What's up on the Griffin? We'll fly over to the beavers. Need to pay them a visit anyways. Steal a little bit of paste, and they might have some rare flowers for us. So that's the one thing we're needing a bunch of. So we can make those beehives. And as you can see, the honey does have a very short spoil timer. Even with the S Plus refrigerator, it does spoil fairly fast. So we kind of need to... I mean, we need to do a lot of stuff. We got to get this ready for going down and stealing an egg. We need to steal some rock trick eggs. We need to make some beehives. There's a lot to get done. See, are we somewhat safe here? Oh, it changed. It usually pops up right here. It's over there now. I think we're all right. Let's go ahead and change these guys out. Are you on passive? You need to be on passive. I do not want you running if I get attacked. When I get attacked, I know I will. Oh, cool. He's actually standing up here, too, so that might be a little bit easier. We'll check around. Oh, there's a feather raptor coming. Yeah, turn around, man. You know what's good for you. Are you getting, getting brave now? Is that what it is? Oh, that's a 130, dude. That would have been a... <laughs> would have been a horrible day. What is... Oh. It's his bleed. I thought something was attacking. He was going to say, I'm not even robbing the nest and the beavers are already eating us. All right. Let's get up in here. Grab all these. Oh, I hear him coming. Oh, dude, they're right there. Man. Uh oh, get me on. <gasps> dude, my Tyla. Get me out. That is a bunch of beavers. Angry ones at that. And a terror bird. He just had to come to the party, didn't he? Dude, I tell you what, man. Oh, those things are not safe. Well. <laughs> wow, man, there's another one. Let's just, um... Can we get up here? We can't get up there. Get up here and change back out to the griffin. <laughs> Dude. Ah, oh, it's always, uh... Always get your adrenaline going when you go to steal some paste from the beavers, you know? Poor little dudes. I mean, no wonder they're so mad, right? I've robbed them probably a good, I don't know, seven or eight times since we've been on this map. Oh, there's feather raptors. Tell you what. Let's do this right here. 
Nothing. Don't want any of it. Cool. Well, what did we get? I didn't even look. Only 10 on the flowers. Okay, not too bad. Uh, quite a bit of paste, so we are good. And there's still that other beaver dam. I'll, I'll rob it again later just to get some more of the flowers and stuff. And let it respawn. Cool, so let's go back and make our tree platform. I want to go set out the taps pretty soon so they can start producing stuff. It takes a while, right? And I think for each one of the mushroom stews, we need... I think it's three of the sap. And they only last like two minutes, so we're gonna need, I don't know, a good five or six to go down with. Just to be safe. I don't plan on being down there too long, grabbing the, the eggs, but dude, there were so many eggs, right? We are gonna be kind of limited on space because they waste so much with the Thyla. So it's like, I wanna pick and choose, but I don't at the same time. I don't know, maybe I'll build a storage right up top. When we're down there, and then we can run down, grab the eggs, come back up, throw them in the chest, go down, grab the eggs, run up, throw them in the chest, and then sort them later. Because I do want to save the rest, and we can do basilisk, basilisk taming with them. That's a hard word to say sometimes. Alright, let's do, let's do this first. Let's throw these into here. Oh, dude, we are short on space. And throw, just throw this into here for now. Kind of for safekeeping. That's a good set of chitin feet right there, too. All right. One tree platform, please. And we already have these. Cool, so make let that make up. Okay, nice. So what are we missing? Is everything else good? We should be able to just run, throw the tree platform out, stop by the cave that's up there, and grab some of the mushrooms, and we need to get the congealed gas, too, on the way back. Let's see, I think that's all the eggs. Grab four honey before we go. Let's grab some of this that's about to spoil. Nice. So that is good. Double check. Yep, we got everything. So, to the redwoods, grab some mushrooms, and we'll have to see. Maybe, if we got enough space left, we'll hit up, well, hmm. We need to hit up the Aberration Cave, too, and that might be a little heavy. Maybe we'll go... Maybe we'll go to the cave over here, grab the mushrooms, come back to base, and change out the griffin for the Argentavis. That way we can throw the mushrooms into the fridge so they last longer, because we're going to need quite a bit of weight to grab all the crystal and the gas. I think the gas is pretty heavy whenever it's not, can, uh, like, smelted up and stuff. And the griffin doesn't have that much carry weight, so... I mean, I could have brought the Argentavis with us, but I want to throw the mushrooms into the... Fridge, because we don't have that many, right? It's kind of hard to get them right now. Let's see. Let's try to throw this out. Oh, dude, that thing cl clips so close to the ground. That is fantastic. We could almost get up here. Just jump in with the Thyla. So, let's get all four of these put out. We'll access them so they'll start pumping. And go and run and do our other stuff. And then hopefully we'll have enough to make our stuff. So it seems to be the same. I don't see any extra options with it being the S plus one. Maybe they hold more? I don't know. All right, cool. Those are all set. So I kind of want to see over here too. I don't know if there's any of the tree stumps kind of like how there is on Valgaro because those things give you so much sap and it's so easy to to get them I don't remember seeing them on this map but I was thinking maybe they'll be here I don't know I don't see any of them though it's a nice little lake though little pond kind of makes me want to build a tree house over here since they don't have the thylas in the trees they're kind of on the ground oh dude it makes life so much better in the redwoods I mean there's already enough stuff over here to Try to attack and kill you anyways, right? Speaking of Thylas... We are in the market for one more here soon. If I can figure out how to use a spyglass, that would be fantastic. Level 20. Not interested. 
wonder if the May Wings have started respawning too. I think this is the May Wing area. I like to get a higher level one that I don't mess up and I don't know, the breeding's weird on them. Apparently, you get eggs from both of them whenever you have two and you're doing breeding since they don't have a gender. I don't know, it's, it's something I have to look into. It's kind of a weird mechanic with them and they drop different quality eggs. I think too, like basic and then ascendant and stuff like that. All right, so here's our cave entrance here. I really need to pay attention whenever we're out doing stuff and try to see where there's mushrooms at other locations. Just so that we're not having to come back here because, well, I mean, it's a cave, right? We got to deal with all the cave creatures just to grab some mushrooms and I do not want to go very far in. So hopefully we get enough. I think it's five of each mushroom. So we're going to need quite a few. Let's go ahead and just kill everything off right here. We're not going very far in. We're just going right here. But I want to make sure we're kind of clear because I will be off of the Thyla, you know? I'm thinking right here, this should be enough. We'll see how many we get. If we can get enough for like 10 of the soups, we should be okay. Be some good levels for the Thyla at least, right? Oh, I don't want to go too far. There's the... I don't know if you can see them. The dragonflies are right over there. Kill this last snake and we should be good. Alright, buddy. You're on... You're on passive still. I don't want you going anywhere. I get attacked. I want you right there for me to jump on. See, we've already got like 12 of each. So that's not too bad. I think we'll be able to get, like I said, around 50 of each one. And that should be enough to uh, to get us because they last two minutes each. And I don't plan on being down in there more than five or ten minutes, right? I'm hoping. Oh, he's taking damage. Oh, dude, my bad, dude, my bad. Should have said something, man. Snakes are trying to get you to take a nap is what it is. Let's move you up here a little bit closer to me. Keep an eye on you. Alright, so that's kind of all the ones that are right here. Let's see where we're at in life. We got 30s, 40s, 40s. What if we can get up here to grab those last couple? Oh, dude. I do not want to fall off because then I can't get back on my Thyla. I'd have to have him fall. Oh, yeah, it's just... <laughs> this will be enough, though. We'll have enough here now. And we'll head out. Like I said, change the Argentavis out and drop these off in the refrigerator. Oh, if we have space. I see that spider coming. All right, buddy, let's get out of here, man. I'm done messing with all these cave creatures. Had to get webbed, didn't you? Had to get webbed at the last second. We were almost clear and free. Now, get away from the cave a little bit. Throw our griffin back out. Let's double check. I don't think you have anything I want to keep. Just a Titan Boa Venom. Everything else is trash. We'll leave it. All right, man. I will see you over on the Lava Island. I'll go ahead and change this guy out for the other one. Put all of our mushrooms away, and I'll see you there. Try to grab us some gas, hopefully, without dying. You know, I totally forgot to bring my otter. I was wanting to grab some of the artifacts while we're in here. I mean, it's an easy enough cave. I come in here quite a bit to grab stuff anyway, so it's not that big of a deal, but I need to start carrying him with us whenever we go into caves for that have artifacts in it. It's kind of the whole point of getting them, you know, so I don't have to go in there so much. No messing with anything in here. Just saying. I know how you are. I should really check his settings just to make sure they didn't reset they didn't cool so first things first we're gonna bypass all of this stuff here i don't want to mess with that ravager that's right here plus we might as well grab that artifact that's down here while we're in here and then we'll come back and yeah there's gonna it's gonna say there's gonna be a patch right here we'll probably just grab those i think we need at least 85 oh i see you perlovius yeah uh-huh Gonna start the day off like that, huh? 
That's right. But I think we just need 85, so that's not too bad. There's more Spinos. There's some more Megalosaurus. Oh, that's a level 100. We definitely need to come in and do some taming on those guys. Let's try not to wake them up. Dude, there's so much stuff. Oh, there's some more, too. There's a green one. Yep, yep, yep. Cool colors on him. Let's see what level these other Spinos are. I don't want to kill them all off, but there's going to be a high level one. I would like to tame an Aberrant version. 25. Is that all we have? What's the other one? It's a Carno. Oh, it's a 150. So let's try to drag him off. Oh, what level are these guys, too? A 55 and a 20. Totally forgot those were there. Let's try to drag this dude off. And not kill him. Oh, the crabs. The crabs are all back. Make sure the drakes aren't following us up here. Is that the 25 left? If so, we'll kill him off. Oh, that's a 150, of course. It's got to be the one I want to keep. Oh, dude, I tried to jump. Oh, man, I couldn't jump. Dude, the Carnos. Um, dude, well, I tell you what. That is straight aberration everything right there. Oh, man. Well, <laughs> let's leave all them down there. Let's go over here, stop messing with stuff. Oh, I totally forgot about those dudes. That's a horrible place to sleep, man. Right in the middle of the road. Uh, now we got the seeker on us. Nope, didn't bother us. All right, let's grab some, some blue mushrooms or hmm, <laughs> not blue mushrooms, some blue gems. Like I said, I think it was just 85 that we needed. We'll just grab a, quite a few. We got some bag of beast too, so it's not that big of a deal. But while we're down here, might as well fill up on them since we do have the Argentavis. All right, we good. Holy crap, man. All right, let's give you these. Yeah, I knew it, you seeker. I need to see if there's any regular crystal on the way out. We are short at base on that. Tell you what, let's just do this. It'll be easier. And I want to change this out. I like the hammer, but at the same time, I don't like it. And we'll hold on to those. All the rest of this, I'm not worried about it. Let's just drop it. Save on some weight. And then... I don't know if there's any of the white crystal packs around here. See, the Ravagers are down here. I don't want to... I want to get caught up with them. Just grab a little bit. A couple hundred should be fine. I'm just running really, really low at base from all the... Changing the windows around, and then all the greenhouse build and stuff like that. I wish I could grow these at base, dude, though. The blue and the white, oh man, they look awesome. We are encumbered, which is not a good thing, being that far away from our team. I don't see the Ravagers, I'm kind of worried, man. Oh, they're down there, I just saw one go flying across the screen, okay. Cool, they're still here. And the roll rats, I do want to come tame those guys too, man. They are so fun to roll around on. They're pretty quick getting around too. Good transport, you know. All right, man, so we got one last stop. Let's get away from here because that seagull was around. I don't want him robbing us. So our last stop will be just right over there. Grab some gas, then we should be able to go back to base and get everything made up. I'll hit up the tree saps, or the tree... Sap, taps, tree tap, saps. You know what I'm saying, right? <laughs> Words are hard sometimes. I'll hit up the redwoods on the way back after we get the gas over here. All right, so we just need a couple. I think it's 150 total, and I don't know if there is a conversion ratio or if it's like one to one. I don't know. So what we're going to do is grab 150. That's how many we need. Can't hit you can hit you. Oh, wait, we're encumbered. I forgot to put everything into the Argentavis. And I think we're supposed to use 
the hatchet on these. I think. That's two. That's three, four. So you get about one on those. Yep, hatchet. I know there was something kind of weird with it whenever I was on extinction. You get, you sh should be able to use the pick, you would think, right? It's kind of weird. It's, uh, not sure which ones we can hit. These should be all fine, though. There we go. So yeah, that basilisk is over here. Whenever we get the rock drake eggs, we should be able to use those. We'll kind of string like a zipline trap like I did whenever we were on Aberration and drop some eggs down to them and tame them that way. Let's drop this. We have got so much stone back at base. So that'll be kind of cool. It's kind of uh, sketchy over here doing that, you know, with everything that's in this area. But it'll, uh, it'll be fun, man. It's a pretty cool little team to have, you know. So there's 170 almost. Let's grab just a tiny bit more. I just want to be sure in case something happens that we have enough. I don't want to have to come back. That's a cool looking Dodic. Level 55. I like the gray, man. All right. Well, let's head back and start getting our stuff made. We should have everything that we need to go ahead and make the hazmat suit. I might need some polymer. I didn't think about that. If so, it's not a big deal. We can get some from the crabs. And then go from there. I do have quite a bit of obsidian back at base, so we can just make some up if it's only a couple pieces that we'll be needing. Back at base. Dude, it has been a long day collecting stuff. And oh man, there was 17 sap in each one of the taps. I think that might be what the S plus one is, is it collects it a lot faster. I was expecting to only have two or three in each one. So that is fantastic. Let's grab this for sure. We'll throw those over here. It needs to kind of smelt up. We'll put a little bit in each one since we have four. And wait, let's see. What's the ratio? Is it one to one? Or one to two? Oh, it is one to one. Man, I thought you got like two or three out of each one when it smelted up. That's uh, that's fine, though. It's not a big deal. We've got plenty. That's what kind of why I grabbed extra, you know? Put the rest into there. So, yeah, we got plenty of sap. We got 68, so not too bad. Let's go ahead and just throw everything into here. And here's us another artifact. Let's go ahead and put it with our other one. It's all it's all guarded by our our shine horns, man. They're uh they're killer shine horns. You don't want to come in here and try to steal anything. Just saying. It's an awesome security system. All right, so let's start building some stuff. Let's do let's do the mushrooms first actually. The mushroom stew or whatever. Don't know why I put all of this into here. We need it. All right, let's take everything out. Well, let's put two of the honey in here. I want to take everything out so we don't have any weird stuff get made. What are we missing? We're missing something. Oh, purple mushrooms. Let's grab some. Uh, not mushrooms, but I'll tell you what, I'm stuck on mushrooms today. The purple berries. I know, we'll get the gardener and stuff set up here soon. The farmer, gardener, whatever it is, and it'll make that a little bit easier. Like I said, I got so much stuff I want to do in just so little time, you know? All right, let's grab everything out. And throw it all into here. So I think we just need these. And then we're going to need these. Oh, we need gas balls too. That's why I grabbed more too. Oh, totally forgot it needs the gas as well. Well, good thing if we grab that extra, extra bit of gas. I think that's all that we need now. Yeah, there we go. Cool. So, a couple of these. They last two minutes, I believe it is. Let's see how many we get out of this. Hopefully enough. We get about five or so, which we should. Well, I know we will. We got plenty of them there. Cool. Let's go ahead and let that just do its thing. And we'll see about our hazmat suit over here.
Nice to think we're gonna have just enough kind of built up. I was kind of worried about the polymer. Congeal gas balls. Four more. Three more. There we go. Nice. We got our full set. I think one set should be fine. Shouldn't need to worry about any more of it. And what do we come up with here? We've got enough mushrooms. Let's grab a little bit more gas. We can probably make one more, I think. It takes three of the sap. I don't know. Putting gas balls into a cooker, it just sounds, sounds a little weird. I'm just saying. Not exactly safe. So that will be ten. That's fantastic. That's how many I was wanting to take down with us. And everything into here. Cool. Well, not too bad of a day today. We got our hazmat suit made. We have our kind of hazmat suit for our thyla made. All I want to do is take a storage cabinet down with us. We'll use the grapple. My plan is to run down in there, kind of grab one egg, kill off as many of the rock drakes as we can, then just steal all the eggs. Put them into the cabinet and then slowly take them back up and filter which ones we want to keep to hatch. So, not too bad of a deal. Hopefully, we'll do that in the next video. But, we are going to go ahead and leave this one here. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you liked our little cooking and fabricating session we had on our hazmat stuff today. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.